Hi Aquarius, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you are well. And this is a general reading for any sun, moon, or rising Aquarius. So we can get a sense of the energies and messages for you. So we have the Eight of Cups, we have the Two of Wands in reverse, and we have the Strength card in reverse, Major Arcana. So the Eight of Cups, we see this woman here with her back to the cups and she's facing in the direction of the moon and we might uh, guess that the next step for her would be to start walking away and walking away from eight full cups is a sign that uh, you're not feeling fulfilled you're not feeling happy with what is going on in your life right now and that you believe that in order to find that satisfaction that you're going to be leaving behind the bounty of eight cups so it is uh, you've reached the point where you feel that it's probably better to take a break to step away to uh, move away from a scenario from a situation and uh, taking this next step you are not certain of what's going to happen and we see that the moon is so bright in this illustration but um, you feel that you have to do it and so this could be as something less uh, on a daily basis of taking yourself out of a challenging situation for example of something at work maybe you're working with some people that aren't that nice and or just are not working well and maybe it's time for you just to take a little break to the extent that you can um, if it means uh, leaving the office for the afternoon or something like that it could be on a smaller level like that or it could be bigger issues within which is uh, a sense of dissatisfaction or something that is taking you to take the steps of walking away and uh, hopefully seeking your truth your happiness your fulfillment or new adventures you know with the eight of cups there's a literal meaning which could be that you also could be leaving on a trip but I do think when you see these cups and you're leaving behind the cups you're you're leaving behind you're willing to leave behind um, some sort of comfort that you've had or some level of security that you have had and it involves taking a risk and moving forward so then we have the two of wands in reverse and in its upright position the two of wands is this finely dressed man who is um, looking out over the horizon and there's the world right here or the globe the globe really has the world in his hands and he's just thinking about the possibilities thinking about the opportunities and so in in reverse you may not see those opportunities you may not be feeling that uh, you may not be feeling you may be lost in a sense of what you want to do and you may not have that focus or uh, the direction that's going to take you to the next step where you're going to explore where you're going to head out and so in reverse there's a, just a sense that there's either a delay or there's a uh, you know you're just stuck a bit you're stuck in thinking about your big picture and where you're headed and perhaps in order to find that clarity of where you're going next and what you want to do next and what path you want to take perhaps you need to leave a current situation or you need to step away from a current situation so with this two of wands in reverse and the eight of cups here we have strength in reverse and strength in its upright position is, is a card telling you that you have the inner strength to handle whatever obstacles challenges that are coming your way and it's encouraging you to be compassionate and gentle and to tame your impulses to not always 
strike back or to use force to try to gain influence. It's to do it through kindness and gentleness and um, you know, self-awareness. And so in reverse, there's a sense here that you don't feel that you have the strength perhaps to make, the, make these things happen. And so what I see is I just see that there's a lot of, you may be having a lot of self-doubt. You may be having uh, just a sense of uh, being in a spot where you don't believe that things may improve. You may be feeling that regardless of the strength that you uh, know that you should have, you're not buying it. And what's going to take you to find perhaps more information, more self-awareness, more happiness is to walk away. And perhaps this message here is to saying that whatever situation you're in right now with the adversity or obstacles that maybe it is a wise move is to take yourself out of it. So, uh, you know, when I see strength in reverse, it's to me, it's self doubt or, uh, there's impulsivity in your behavior or things that, you know, you're just making, um, uh, some forceful decisions when you might be better served by backing it up a bit by, um, getting more control, self-control. So we have this sense of uh, feeling that you don't have the inner strength or the, the ability to handle some situations. You have, you're less clear and less focused on what your future may hold for you. And here's the Eight of Cups, which is walking away from comfort, walking away from eight full cups, abundance, uh, in order to find either peace, serenity, tranquility, happiness, whatever it may be that you feel that you're lacking, that this is movement and transition to try to find that. And uh, so quite an interesting spread for Tuesday. So let's take a look at what we have in terms of numerology. We have an eight and two is 10, and that's another eight. So that's 18 and that reduces to nine and nine is about spirituality. It's about wisdom, nearing completion. So perhaps you have to go through some steps and through, and, uh, through some thinking in order to find out where you're headed in order to turn this two of cups around and to turn this strength card around as well. So let's pull an Oracle card and let's get a little more information. Experiencing grace. So let's see what this says. Share your gifts with grace. Waves of inspiration and love are coming to you. So it's such a, uh, I love the word of, of living life with grace. And to have, it's that self um, awareness. It's, uh, uh, it is showing gentleness and kindness and compassion, compassion. When I think of grace, I really do think of the strength card in its upright position. It's strength through grace. It's strength through compassion, strength through um, uh, vulnerability as well. So be graceful in however you move forward. And as you move forward, things will begin to become more clear to you. And this is, I think, the first step in self-awareness and understanding what's, um, you know, what's going on in your life that if something isn't working out a job a relationship a situation that uh, you can always take yourself out of it and maybe it's temporary until you clear your head and think about things or perhaps it's more permanent so i hope that you have a if you found this reading helpful please subscribe like share comment that would be great and come back tomorrow for another daily tarot reading thank you so much bye bye